Welcome back Poke fans to what's going to be a brand new playthrough of Pokemon Vanguard so if you've been subscribed to me for a while this would have been one of the main like series that I did ages ago now but what we were doing every time they were releasing an update we were carrying on from where we'd left off but it's been that long since there's been an update and everything has previously been revamped so from my original playthrough a lot of the like towns and stuff look different now because of this revamp and with the release of version 3.0 as well and more story i genuinely forgot most of it so i thought it'd be good to just start from the beginning and see everything that's changed so let's go ahead and jump on in this is however one of the best fan games that i've ever played like if i remember anything it was that i was so addicted to the story so let's close all that and new game welcome to project vanguard public beta 3.0 this game includes a slight bit of foul language somewhat dark themes and some flashing lights we do not claim ownership of the public assets used for this game we have not nor shall we ever profit from this game in any way this also includes donations which we have never taken or plan to take ever but with that aside, let's begin your adventure. Which difficulty mode would you like to play on? Um, let me just see what this is now. So casual mode offers an easy experience that's more balanced in the player's favour. We still offer difficulty to those with little to no competitive Pokemon knowledge. Normal mode is balanced in the favour of players with competitive knowledge offering a more challenging experience. We shouldn't disallow the player to use what Pokemon they desire to. Expert mode will bring forth the full potential of regional variants and Pokemon rebalances. Creating a truly difficult experience. Um, you know what I was? I'm, I'm in an hour between casual and normal, but I think I'm going to go normal. Oh, okay. There's a female character to play as now. Or a different character, should I say. Because obviously I, I'm not 100% sure if he's a female. So yeah, I'm going to use that one. Let's go with the right one. Uh, we've got obviously be called Pokey X. I'm actually so excited to replay this. Would you like to enable double battle only mode? No. Would you like to play on streamer mode? Why? There's some tracks that are specifically chosen for the game that may result in your uploaded content in this game to be blocked in certain countries. Should be able to place those tracks with safer ones. I highly suggest enabling this if you plan on making public videos. Um, okay, yeah. Would you like to do my own one? No. Would you like to skip the initial cutscene? No. Pokex. I remember this part where it's like someone's talking to you. So it's finally time. Haha. <laughs> What's our purpose in this world? It's bothered me. Kept me up at night. But at least... I'm glad you found yours. Which is why... There's a terrible burning pain in my heart. Over the fact that in a few days... I might never see you again. I don't want you to promise me that you'll come back. I just want you to enjoy these final moments that we have together. Pokex. And that's it. If I remember right, for the for ages you have no idea what is going on. Chapter one awakening level cap eight. Ah, oh, where? My head. Where am I? Oh great, you're finally awake. Where the hell am I? Shh, keep it down dude, there's no reason to be so loud. What? Where am I? This girl, who is she? That's right. Those things, that woman I heard. It wasn't a dream. Hey, hey. You're gonna tell me like, you know, your name. My name? My name is Pokex. Yeah, that's right. My name is Pokex. Okay. 
Well, my name is Destiny. You seem like a weird kid, but that's okay. Destiny. So, where am I? You don't remember. I found you in the park completely unconscious. You're spouting about a bunch of weird phases that I couldn't quite make out. Since there isn't a hospital in this town, I decided to bring you back home. So I guess you don't have anything to do with this. With what? The fact that I just can't remember anything. Besides my own name, of course. So wait, you have like amnesia or something? I, uh, I guess. Hmm. Oh crap. I forgot I was supposed to meet my mum at her office. Oh, I'm totally going to be late. Wait. Jeez, she's fast. God, what the hell is going on? Right, um... Is there anything... Other... Oh, I can actually change character. Change everything, okay. I can also definitely change the difficulty, so that's good to know. Something in the trash. Because ultimately, I'd like a little bit of a challenge, but I don't want it to the point of where, like, it's taking me forever to, like, win big battles. Because then, I don't know, especially, like, with doing videos every day, if it's taking me hours to get past a certain part, it, it really puts a strain on me being able to um, upload every day. So if it gets to that point, I'll probably just have to lower the difficulty. But for now, we'll just leave it as it is. Um, okay, so this looks way different. Like, I remember it being like a city, kind of. Isn't my Pokemon adorable? Yeah, this looks nothing at all like what... It was when I first played it, or when I first started doing the playthrough on this. Charizard Go. We aren't old enough to have our own Pokemon, so instead of playing with cards. A candy store? This didn't exist either. Some it's changed Pokemon's nature. Man, this candy's awesome for my Pokemon, but it tastes very weird. That's because it's for your Pokemon and not you. That's like them people that eat that try their dogs like chews and stuff like it's, just, it's not for you it's for dogs we sell gummies to increase the IVs of Pokemon okay IVs as well I can't I think there might have been something for IVs but I don't think they're called gummies but I might be wrong there there's also a proper Pokemon center in here as well and these look different Love watching the people in Pokemon come through here. It's just a mind that life will never not be filled with joy. Which could become a trainer, but I'm just not strong enough. Honestly, the glow up from when I first played this to now is unreal. Um, Min Revive. Thousand. I don't... I'm pretty sure as well that... You couldn't buy, you couldn't get revised for ages. I might be wrong. Anyway, we'll buy some of them. Get two of them. Get. Oh, I messed up there. I should have got ten. We will buy one win revive just in case. So what do you sell? Oh yeah, trainer points. I remember that. Yeah, you used to be able to use it to get. Pokemon as well, so different Pokemon centers used to sell different Pokemon. There's a Bidoof here somewhere. I'm guessing you can't get anything in this grass. Win it. That's what I constantly think to myself in battle. Where did I put my phone? If I lose it, Dad will surely take my Pokemon away. Okay, yeah, so they, they stop you from going any further. Mommy talks about weird stuff. Being a single mother is the hardest thing in the world. I have to hold a job and take care of my daughter. Yeah, the, the struggle is real, I'm not going to lie. There's a strange book, Pokemon on Route 1, that looks nothing like the pictures of it in these books. Crazy, right? 
So yeah, I've I've had a dot within like the last year, and like it's my first child, and obviously I've I'm living my missus like so we we raise it together and that can sometimes be challenging like when you're on your own with her so and that's like every now and then like if she's out doing something or whatever and it's my turn to look after her but if you had no other choice and it was just you and her like you and a child i could imagine especially when the like you're going through a bit of a, a rough day where the baby's just constantly crying and stuff like that i could imagine that being very 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 tough so hats off to anyone who's a single parent it's nearly every child's dream to become a pokemon trainer i think it's a scary job to be honest back in my day 10 year old kids would become the champion of the pokemon league while taking down criminal organizations nowadays you'll just sit around and fatten yourselves up with our tax money <laughs> all right what we've got upstairs so it looks like every bin seems to have something useful items as well really Looking for a Pidgey. I want to trade it for my Sandile. Ah, oh, you know what? I would actually take that trade because I do love me a, a Crocodile. I'll have to remember that. Okay, let's head across here. This city's so small and somehow I'm last. This is super cool candy shop in town. My dad just brought me back a bunch of tights up. Ooh, some gummies. Yeah, so what I'm going to try and do in this playthrough is use Pokemon that I didn't last time. So I remember last time I used a lot of Dragon types and my team was quite unbalanced. Whereas I'm going to try and get a bit of a balance this time. Plus, there's also a lot more regionals now. Our son ran away from home to become a Pokemon trainer. I know it's a lot to spill on a random person. Yeah, really. But he said something about wanting to join the Vanguard Academy. Really wish he would come home. And the mum, or I'm assuming it's the mum, is just lost for words. All right, got a burn heal. Okay, and so let's now head to the laboratory, which is where the story is going to progress. Got XP Candy Eye, which gives you a little bit of XP. I think it's like a hundred. And then I was all like, uh, do you mind? I swear to God, this guy will not shut up about something once he starts talking. Supposedly one of the employees here was a high-ranking Pokemon trainer when they were younger. Isn't that crazy? Hmm? I think I might know who you're talking about too. Up to the second floor we go. Thought a job at a Pokemon Research Center would be fun. But instead I'm just stuck editing spreadsheets all day. Okay, I got XP candy again. Huh? Oh yeah, I'm playing games. Can't be asked to do half the stuff I'm supposed to do, honestly. And there's a bunch of rare Pokemon stored in the basement. Guess that could explain why almost no one's allowed down there. Yeah, this I think this has changed as well. Seriously, I can finally have my own Pokemon. Yep, as I promised before, I brought you Pokemon for your 16th birthday. Does this mean I can finally apply for the Vanguard Academy? Destiny was talked about this already. I don't want... Oh crap, Pokéx. Wait, I totally forgot about you. Oh my god. Destiny, who is this? They're, uh, I'm, uh, Destiny's friend. F friend? Y yeah, that's right. Pokéx is a friend I was having over. I thought you didn't have any friends. Mom. Well, I do now. So I'm going to take my friend to the park, my new Pokémon. Wait. Come on, let's go. Destiny, wait. And she's gone. Pokex was it? Y yes. Could you please go after her? I just don't want to cause any trouble with a new Pokemon. I uh, gear. I mean, sure. Thank you. Right, and then this is where it all kicks off. And we've ended up in the basement. Wait, this is... Did the elevator break? It won't budge. Maybe there's a way out through here. Yes, you can't actually interact with it yet. Uh-oh. Oh my god, they've changed as well. 
They've got a glow up. That looks so much better. So this is the place we were told about. Yeah, the boss said we shouldn't have a problem taking all these Pokemon. Apparently they haven't installed much security down here since most of the public doesn't know it exists. Alright then, let's finish this quickly. Grab everything you can. Those guys. What's going on here? Why am I here? No. I can't lose my call now. I need to figure a way out of this. I don't think those guys saw me, so I'll use that to my advantage. I can make a run for the elevator, and then one of these Pokeballs. I could use them to fight back if needed, but I'll only take one. I don't think it would be right to steal these, even in a situation like this. Alright, let's start from the bottom. Oh. Uh, maybe the... Oh, no. Okay, so Sprigate... Oh, my God. Gen 9 have also got regionals now. So, goes to poison. It's hidden abilities, protein. Is this Pokemon you want? No. Oh, for, oh no. For Aiko, go stay the same. Oh, my God. Quaxley looks hella cool. Technician, mind tuning, water psychic. Flying tight route, yeah. I, I think I saw this on um, Avery, the developer's um, Twitter. Chest spin. Huh? The Pokeball's sparkling. Oh, I think that means it's shiny. Super luck. Yeah, we're gonna have to go for something with a um a what you call it? Like a regional. Electric sound grookey. Electric surge wind power punk rock. Um score bunny stays the same. Chikorita's grass fairy. Cyndaquil, a fire ghost, water dragon totodile. See, I feel like drought on um, Cyndaquil could kind of work. Dark ground stamina weak armor, sand stream, Charmander, rock fairy, fur coat, berserk, sheer force. Fighting. Bulletproof shell armor guts. Bug type Trico. Ghost fighting torture with country. Ah oh man, this is so hard to choose. Grass eyes turtwig. That's also a shiny. Fire poison chimchar. Auto electric piplup. Psychic steel. Fire ground tepig. Water dark. Usher what? Oh man. Yeah, I can't. I really can't decide. What was the square or fighting type? I feel like fighting type. Mm. Bulletproof shell armor guts. Oh my god. I mean, I could have a guts squirrel. Uh, I'm going to be here forever. I was also kind of vibing with the Grookey. Electric Surge, Punk Rock, Wind Power. But yeah, Drought. Drought could really be useful. I mean, we can get some of these, like, later on as well, because they appear in dens now. Yeah, I think I said ages ago that on Twitter that I was going to do 
possibly use Blastoise, so I think I'm going to go Squirtle, but I just, I'm not sure what ability I'm going to go with. Would you like to set initial values for Squirtle? Yes. We're going to go Adamant because he's... I think he's going to be a physical attacker because he's got guts. Oh no, I can't get... Never mind. Um, we'll go Shell Arm because then we can't be crit. And yeah, we'll just stick with Fairy. Something attached, yeah, ability patch. I don't know if I want guts though, that's the only thing. Not the best IVs, but that can obviously be increased with gummies. Iron Barber, that's a new move. Has it become fighting still? Alright, let, let's actually progress the story after spending like 10 minutes trying to decide. Huh? What the hell is some kid doing down here? Guess I'm not making out of here unscathed. Who cares? Brought my own Pokemon for a reason. Hope you're ready to go down. Alright, let's see what these actually look like now. Yeah, that looks a lot better. Originally, it was just like a hooded hooded guy. Ah, Pidgey's grass flying. Um, okay. I'm sure there's a speed up one, but I can't remember what it is. Spam that iron barb. That kid left my Pokemon pretty damn wounded. Unfortunately, our friend upstairs is the only one with the machine, so I'm out of this fight. Machine? What are they talking about? Whatever the Pokemon are wounded as well. I'll finish them off. But wait. H who the hell? Hey, kid, whoever you are, you might want to get behind me. H hey, wait a sec. Hit him with a whirlwind sweller. Th thank you. So you use one of my Pokemon? Alright, well, don't stress over it. You didn't seem to have a choice in this situation. My name's Alf, but let's spare any more introductions for now. A bunch of renegades have infiltrated the building. My sister's holding them off, but we need as much help as we can get before the rangers arrive. I handle the situation down here. Use that Pokemon to help upstairs. Alright, take this too. Uh, yeah, that was a quality of life that they added last last update so to me this is such a great quality of life like an item so it's basically a repel that you can turn on and off and if it's on you just don't get encounters because i remember playing when i played this before there was some areas that were so hard to get through because just constant encounters use this arm to quickly proceed through the routes if necessary uh, all right and it's all kicking off up here Oh, it's you. Alf told me to come up and help fight. But you'd... Uh, some brother gave you one of his Pokemon. I'm not in a situation where I can leave this building without being stopped by one of them. All my Pokemon are currently in use, so I need you to go outside and find Destiny. Uh, Alright. As much as I want to figure out what's going on right now, I need to find that girl. She could be in danger. Alright, you can't get that way. Can I now... Get an encounter here. Yeah. Oh, that music's so good. So we've got a flying water fletchling. I want to pass on that. I want to see if I can find a PG. Teddy, a second character chop. That was really good XP, actually. Obviously the level caps are at 8. That's another thing that I love about the game, like hard level caps. Applin. Is there an encounters list? There is. Right, there's two things that we're missing. A bug electric caterpie is one of them. I might actually catch this. If 
There we go. Right, I'm assuming it's going to be... Sound, I don't know. I never know the best hidden power to set it as, because I'm not sure what IV is that means. But to, to be fair, if you want my honest truth, I'm probably going to look at changing all their IVs to just max IVs and everything. So if like from one video you check and you see you see their IVs aren't that great and then all of a sudden you check and like they're all max, that'll be why. I think I've saw everything here, yeah. So let's just run in here and heal. And now we're gonna head on up to the route, training tips. Can you allocate EV points in the Pokemon stat screen? More EVs will be gained by level up. Please be sure to bring your own Pokemon or be acquainted with someone who owns one before proceeding. All right then, route one. Let's see what Pokemon we can find here. Still appears to be the same. Yeah, there's two that we're missing. Hopefully one's a Pidgey. In fact, let's lead with Caterpie. You should know an electric move, surely. No, you don't. Oh, okay. Let's not lead, do you? Although, I've got a uh, candy, haven't I? Right, let's find these last two encounters. A fire fairy cutie fly. Take that out, why not? Although, actually, now I think about it, it wasn't worth it. Come on, I just want the last encounter. That's all I want. That's not it. It's got to be the PG, surely. Another Caterpie. You always find that one Pokemon, don't you? One Pokemon that just hates a bit doof. Okay. Well, then let's carry on. My little skitty loves to be walked. Love playing with the Pokemon here. Okay, we've got a great ball. I can't remember now if these Pokemon you can encounter. No. I'm sure you used to. Squirtle's now at the level cap. On slow rollout. Um, I'm going to pass on that. I've got a feeling that that Poochiena, you can encounter it. No. And then you got these boxes where you get loads of handy items. Um, let's follow it up this way. It's a dead end, but the might. Oh no, you can't go through there, you need to cut there. Right then, let's continue on. To be fair, I should just put that infinite repel on. I'm 
Now we won't get encounters. Battle me now. Cutie fly. You know though, if I did have rollout, we would have absolutely annihilated this thing. Retata. Which is now rock steel. I think it was just rock type before. I don't know, it might be rock normal. Actually, yeah, I've got, I've got that wrong. It's got sturdy as well. How annoying is that? Especially when you keep missing. Shinx. Oh, I've messed up here. I wanted to use a Luxray, but I forgot he was fighting type, so. Yeah. Maybe Luxray won't be getting work used. String Spit, it's not very effective. Oh, yeah, of course, it's not because it's electric type. Let's go out into Squirtle. Why did I just do that? I genuinely thought we'd live one. So let's see how much these mini revives work. Oh my god, they are very min. Right now we'll switch into squirrel. Karate chop. Okay, I want to um, want to use my potion. Yeah, we should be good. Oh no, that's just a shortcut. Oh snap! See, so can encounter some Pokemon. What? I was trying to figure out what that was then. Okay, we've got a potion. We've got some orange berries and some petcha berries. Right then, let's head across the bridge. Oh yeah, buddy. I remember these. Although, that looks different now. Steel poison. I had one of these. I'm gonna catch it again. Remember right it was when it was a rose raid, it was really good for me. Um I think it's a physical attacker. Rattled or poison point, go poison point. Yikes, I'm really struggling with this assignment. Like, if only there was a strong trainer that could help me. How rude? That is so rude. Alright. We need to, um. Oh, actually, I've got candies, haven't I? Landed Electro Web. Right, let's lead off with Caterpie. Let's make this battle up to remember. Ooh, Fanpy, that's new. Never seen that before. Water type. Let's go Electro Web. It's got Sturdy, of course. So Caterpie's got a lot of speed control, I've noticed. Vanillae, yeah. Fire type. Ah, oh, you burnt me. I swear, I wish I had guts now. I can't quite make out what it is. Is it fire ground? 
In anyway, Squirtle's gone. Squirtle's gone. Electro, wherever you are, is ground. Well, it looks like um, Bannerlight's done some serious decimation to my team. Oh my god, that's a quad weakness. We got so lucky there. Ah, oh, there's more Pokemon. There's more Pokemon. I like that Zigzagoon. Um, Buddy wants Slam Bite. Pass on that. Right, we definitely need to run back and heal because uh, I think we've got what one HP. So let's head down here. I never looked at what type that um, Zigzagoon was. I think it was normal, normal fairy. Can't be a hundred percent sure though. All right, let's head across here again. And yeah, we're good. So the way we need to go. Ooh, don't know what we eat now, but we'll be strong someday. Well, if dive fishing, it's a spinner rack, isn't it? Right, found a potion there. And two XP candies, which I'll gladly take from you. Why do people think bugs are weird? Um, I'm not sure, but Cappy versus Cappy, what we're we saying. Need like a fire type or something. Oh my god. Has it taken us three hits to take this out? Weedle is just a bug type. So I think that means it's neutral, yeah. Combi, we know is bug flying, so we'll go out into Caterpie. Let's go Electro Web. That's right, give me all your money. Oh, we've run into another combi. Okay, I am thinking of doing the EVs, so I think I'll go attack. Oh, they've changed it as well now. So it used to be attack and special attack was like both at the same time. Or am I thinking of a different game? And then for you, you want to go special attack and speed. Right, let's follow it around. Another trainer bell. Aracuda, that's good for me. Electro web. Scatterbug. Scatterbug, scatterbug. I'm just staying. Pursuit doesn't do much, does it? Uh, why did I think that that resisted? And ice rock. Ice ground. Sandile. Actually, now I, now I think about it, I... I did use that for a bit at some point. Did not expect to lose this battle. 
you know what I've decided we're gonna catch something else as well because obviously the more options we have the better so we're gonna catch the fletchling there we go perfect let's go string spit So we'll have four Pokemon. Right, we're gonna go modest. We'll just stay with sound. Alright, so it's got swift swim and it just knows gust. Turn that back on. I didn't even see what that said. It's not an like underwater gun though. It's now known as water gun. Oh, powder snow? Okay. It's different. She used potions. And we're good. Ah, oh. why is it that happens to me? No matter what game I play, that always happens to me. Use all my healing items, and then I literally walk straight into someone who heals me. Sometimes journey can be longer than tougher than expected. Thankfully, that's what I'm here for. Yeah, because now we're, we're fully rested. And also, you know when that's coming up, when that comes up, like you're coming up to a big battle. Here we go. N no, it, it's not fair. I b beat b both of you t twice. Did you really expect us to play fair? Damn kids these days, move the hell out of the way. First hand over your badges, those will sell for big bucks. But badges? Huh? She doesn't have a single badge. No way, but she beat us both twice. She's not even a trainer. Tch. Whatever, her Pokemon will get us something at least. Ah... Hey, wait a sec. Seriously? Another one? Well, more money for us, I guess. Alright, kid, prepare to die. Alright, Pidove got an upgrade. It's now Fairy Poison. Fairy Poison. I'm going to Squirtle. Hopefully, it doesn't hit me with Fairy Move. Yep. And it just got a speed increase. Should have gone out into Budu actually. That would have made more sense. That growl just saved your baker. Murkrow. Now I'll go out into Caterpie. Electro web. Oh, it did live there. Doesn't have Sucker Punch yet, though. Seriously, you won? Yeah, that's right, I won. And I'll keep fighting until you let her go. No matter how many times you hear your Pokemon or whatever, I'll keep going. This feeling. I've only this girl for a few hours, and I barely know how to use Pokemon. Before, I couldn't even move. But now... But no, I can't let them get away with this. Pokex, P please, whatever crazy thing you're about to do, j just do don't worry about it. I'll beat these guys over and over again. A hundred times if I have to. Fortunately, that won't be necessary. But what the hell? Are you two kids alright? Yeah, good. Look, man, I don't know where you came from, but prepare to do. Well, did you shut up already? Did you just kill them? Oh, no, don't worry. Here's a Pokemon to walk them to the nearest ranger station. Haha, <laughs> the look they must have on their faces. Amazing. Let's get your kids home now, shall we? Yeah, I remember that character. Kind of. A little bit. D Destiny is she. She's fine. But first, Pokex. Who are you? 
Um, I understand that you saved my door, but you randomly showed up the same day that Renegades attacked. And I know for a fact no one has moved into this city within the past year. So tell me, PokeX, who are you? Well, to tell you the truth, I don't know who I am. Excuse me? Your daughter, she said she found me completely unconscious. When I awoke, I couldn't remember anything besides my own name. And you expect me to believe this? Ah, <sighs> Jackie, what reason would the kid have to lie? Keith, you... I can tell for a fact that you really do believe them. But do you think the Renegades attack has to do with their sudden appearance? Well, the Renegades didn't exactly seem to have any interest in Pokéx, but calling it a coincidence seems very far-fetched. Considering how abnormal the events are, Pokéx, yes. If your story's true, where did your sudden knowledge of Pokémon battling come from? I don't know. When the Renegades approached me, it was like a sudden rush of adrenaline flew through the, my body. And in an instant, I knew what I had to do. Hmm. With your claim, I can assume you have nowhere to go, right? I guess. As much as I want to find out what the hell is going on. I have no idea where to start. May I make a suggestion, then? The truth is, I'm the head of a nearby Pokemon Academy. And after the way you acted on Route 1, I'd like to personally invite both you and Destiny to the Vanguard Academy for Pokemon trainers. Keith, you can't be serious. I am. Those two have quite the potential. And... As much as I respect your decision of holding Destiny back, I just can't see why you're going to let that go to waste. Pokecats, okay, well I don't completely trust or know who you are, but I beg of you, please keep my daughter safe. I, I will. I promise. Alright then kid, pack your bags. If you have any that is. I don't. Then let's go, shall we? Well as soon as Destiny wakes up. We can get pretty close to our destination by taking a train from Archon Station. It's just to the east of where you fought off those renegades. Chapter, oh uh, no, Act 1 now. Chapter 2, Vanguard Academy, level cap 12. Wait, seriously, you actually let me go? Yes, I'm letting you go. Did you think I was joking? Oh my god, this is actually happening. I get to go become a Pokemon trainer. Not only that, but at the best academy in South Western Airy. Destiny. Like, I thought I would have to sneak out of something, maybe even fake my own death. Wait, no, that wouldn't work. Destiny. Huh? Please. Be safe, okay? Y yeah. I mean, of course, right? Keith. Yeah, don't worry about it. She'll be fine, I promise. Everything will be. Alright, I should make my way to Archon Station, like Keith said. He also said it was to the east of the place before the grunts. Alright then, well, I think that'll be the perfect place to end today's episode. So, yeah. So excited to be getting into this again. Um, like I said, there's already been so many changes from like when I first played this. And I'm really eager to see more and more. But yeah, thank you everyone for watching. And I hope to see you all next time.